so I work in one of these like corporate office settings, right? Like I call them like a, a cubicle prisons, you know. Uh, you, like you go in in the morning, you check in at like eight, and then you're paroled at like noon for half an hour, right? And then you go back in, and then you're paroled again like at four, and the next day you check back in again at eight, right? And then like you're paroled again at noon for half an hour. You do that like. Uh, Monday through Friday, right? And then you're paroled on the weekends. Anyways, I work in one of these settings, right? And there's one thing that the other uh, co-workers, you know, like the other inmates do. It's really annoying. They'll come up to you and they'll say like, oh, like I just got a quick question. Oh, a quick question. It's got a quick question, you know. Or they'll say like, yeah, I just got, I got a real uh, easy question for you. Real easy, quick question, you know. And they'll always come like you're really busy, or you're training someone, there's someone in the office with you, and they come in, I just got a quick, quick, easy question. Dan, I got this real quick. It's so quick, I'm going to be here, and I'll be gone before you even know it. It's like really quick, quick question. What they're really saying is, like, I'm not bothering you. It looks like I'm bothering you, but I'm really not, you know. It only appears... uh you know, that I'm bothering you, but it, it's only an appearance. I'm really not bothering you because I have a really quick, easy question. So even though it looks like I'm interrupting you while you're doing something else, I'm really not because it's quick and it's easy. You know, and normally these quick, easy questions involve you like pulling files and getting out Excel spreadsheets and checking numbers and calling someone else, you know. It's... It's funny how these quick, easy questions, like, evolve into these long, drawn-out, you know, processes. Uh, but no, it's just a quick, quick, easy question. I assure you, my question is very quick and easy. Now, earlier I said that these are cubicle prisons. And that's not really fair, you know, to call these situation prisons. You know, because in prison, you would, like, make a shiv, you know, out of, like, a toothbrush or a comb, or a bed coil, or something, right? You'd make a shiv. And if someone came to you and said, I got a quick, easy question, and stayed there for like 10 minutes, you'd take the shiv and you'd stick them. You'd stick them with that shiv, you know? You can't really do that, like, you know, where I work. If you, like, stuck someone with a shiv, they'd probably call you, like, into HR, you know? And they'd say, like, Dan, we need to talk to you about your performance, you know? Uh, it's very frowned upon using like a shiv made out of an old Bic pen. You know, you stalk George uh, from accounting with a shiv. And if you, as you can clearly see in our HR guidelines, that is frowned upon, okay? So, so please, when someone comes to you and says, I got a quick question, don't stick them with a shiv. Because it like bleeds all over the cubicle felt, you know, and it's really hard to get out. We got to pay extra for our cleaning staff to come in and get rid of the blood from the cubicles, you know. So, so you shouldn't do that anyways.